What's up fam and thank you so so much for stopping by the channel once again from us over here at Locust and Wild Honey. So I'm currently on my balcony waiting for Gabby to arrive because I'm taking her to the San Diego Zoo and I thought it might be fun to take you guys with us, just kind of vlog it, document it and I have a big surprise for Gabby. So I just found out that her favorite band is coming to town, Bethel Music. Um, they're, do they're doing this thing called Worship Nights and essentially it's just like one night concert type of thing. And it's really one of her favorite bands ever and I got her tickets. It's it I got her tickets last minute, so I don't know how great the seats are gonna be, but I got tickets nonetheless. She has no idea about it. I suck at keeping surprises, so what I'm gonna do is like kind of make it like super inconspicuous and just kind of be like, I don't know, like after the zoo, just just be really, really subtle about it. And hopefully we get a good reaction out of it. That would be cool. But yeah, guys, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a good time. And for those of you who don't know who Bethel Music is, I'm gonna I'm gonna show you who they are right now. into a life of adventure. You are the faith behind a simple step, a wild leap. You are the place where fear is powerless and love remains the victor. You are the unshakable yes that our spirits sing of. With courage, we step toward the unknown and not away from it. We breathe in hope and exhale doubt, moving past fear into freedom. Moment by moment, we listen for your voice and learn to respond. We're free to risk because no challenge or pain can rival your love. Unafraid of failure, we are determined to trust you more than our own understanding. You are as good as you say you are, and you make us brave. They're definitely a really powerful band. Uh, one of my all-time favorite worship uh, bands. Probably right there next to Hillsong, but um, yeah, definitely an awesome band. And I'm really excited to, to take you guys with us. Today's uh, not really gonna be so much about fashion or clothing or anything like that, but um, I thought it be, would be cool for you guys to get to see uh, more into like our personal life as well. So um, yeah, that's what today's uh, vlog's gonna be about. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by the channel again, and let's go ahead and get today started. So you guys ask me for room tours all the time, or closet tours, and honestly my room's really not that special. Just a bed, a TV, I have like a chalkboard, cork board over there, big mirror, my bathroom, and this is my closet. Um, I have a bunch of boots and stuff up there. One of them is missing, uh, these Chelsea's, which goes on that spot right there. Um, I have some other shoes as well. I have these moccasins and my two vans, the checker and all black ones that you probably saw on the last channel. And here are my Adidas right here. Uh, I got the 750s, got the Y3s, um, NMDs. I just got these NMDs. And yeah, that's pretty much it. There's really nothing like, you know, too, too crazy about my closet. I have stuff color coordinated. So, I mean, yeah, it's it's really, really not that special. I mean, there's some really cool closets out there, but mine's not one of them. Yeah. Hey, girl. Hi. Gabby just got here. Let's, uh, let's go down there and get her and greet her. I think she's on the phone, but... It's okay. <laughs> I 
you know you don't think that. Hi, babe. Hi, honey. Wait, where are you going? Oh, hang, hang, hang. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to... Busy, busy girl. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get out of here, man. What's up fam, so we just got here to Islands. This has been our spot to stop every time we go to San Diego. We are zoo pass holders uh, to the uh, San Diego Zoo, so and yeah, we go pretty frequently, we try to at least. It's great walking, getting those Fitbit steps in. Anyways, Gabby, what, what, what do you suggest people get at Islands? Well, if you're on a diet, I suggest the chopped salad, and if you're not on a diet and you want to eat a yummy eat burger, the pineapple Hawaiian burgers is really good. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Too much power. So we just got done at lunch. Yeah. Very, very good. Yeah, fam? Yeah, fam. Anyways, um, getting back in the car to continue our journey, our 60 mile journey to San Diego, to the zoo. So we're gonna play the getting to know you game or <laughs> questionnaire. All right. Sometimes he makes me feel like such a dork. <laughs> Is that what, I do that? Yeah. I do that, okay. I love you. I love you too. Um, Alright, let's do it. A lot of questions I get is like, about us specifically, is how did you and I meet? Let's see if you can get this one right. Pressure's on. We, we met in middle school. Yeah. I saw Paul in his basketball jersey and oh. shorts with his spiky oh, hair and his... My Air Force Ones. Ed Hardy. No, that was that, that was jeans. A, that was it. That was that was in middle school. That was high school. Okay, he says it's high school, but I know he was wearing that in eighth grade. Right, my favorite thing about you is I think that you are the most compassionate person on the face of this planet. I'm not. Like you should you show this level of empathy, guys. Like she's such a gem. Like if I'm upset, like if I'm upset, she literally has this like special ability to put herself exactly where I'm at and like understand and it's crazy and I think it has a lot to do with like her effort she really tries to to love me well and I, I don't take it for granted that's, that's got to be number one at the top of my list is um, just a level of empathy that you have for me all the time like whether it's through joy or happiness or sadness or anger or distraught whatever it may be I think you have a special gift of being able to understand people where they're at and um, just being there, being available. That's really sweet. <laughs> we just got here, just parked. Oh man, this is a tight parking spot. How was that drive, honey? It was okay. It's really long. Fam, we're here in the jungle and we found our first creature. Here we go. Look. Wow. We call this creature the Pikachu. The Pikachu? Pikachu. <laughs> Look at its beak, it's Pikachu in at you.
so the zoo was like way too hot honestly and Gabby and I just tapped out I was way too tired I was oves. Yeah, she was oves too. Uh, Usually I love the zoo, but today was just too hot. Yeah. Um, what do we want to do? Should we go home? I don't know. What do you want to do? I mean, what is there to do, San Diego? We can go downtown, go to dinner or something. Yeah, or let's go. Let's go with you know what? I had a list of things to do. Uh, I think it's in the glove box. You think you can grab it? For here, in on the glove box. Okay. Is it? Yeah, I think that's it. What is that, baby? What is that, Paul? What is that, baby? Paul? Is that today? Yes. No. Yeah. Right now? Yeah, we're going, babe. No. I got his tickets. No, you week. didn't. Yeah, I swear. Yes, we're going. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. Oh How random gosh. was that? Yeah, do you have any idea? Wait, no, I don't have a, I don't have a good outfit. Seriously, okay. I forgot to bring my pants. <laughs> I don't okay. have a dress. We, we can figure it out, baby. No, oh my god, I'm so excited. Bethel is so awesome. Look at fam. This is Bethel. Fam. <laughs> Paul surprised me because he's the greatest and I love him so much. Look at this fam. Bethel, I'm so excited. We're taking you with us. We're taking you with us right now to Bethel in San Diego. I'm, I'm so excited. So we just got into the theater. Actually, our seats aren't that bad because it's open seating and we got to the theater early, so. We got here. It's not too bad. Wow. So now I know why everybody's here so early. It's because it's open seating, which is awesome. Vlog. My voice is pretty much shot. It oh, your voice! Amazing. Absolutely incredible, man. It's crazy how faithful God is, bro. It really is. Like He's so, so faithful. Honestly, like our God is the type of God where He can come expectantly and know that He's gonna, He's just gonna show up in profound ways. So. And He did. It's so, so good, man. So, anyways, thanks for as coming we, with us. Yes, absolutely. And as we end every vlog here at Locust Wild Honey, we say peace, be blessed. Be blessed.